Governor Ron DeSantis saying that almost 25,000 fully vaccinated Floridians have now tested positive for COVID-19. Good evening, I'm Keith Kate. I'm Jennifer Lee. Thank you for joining us. Nationwide, the CDC is reporting 35,000 breakthrough cases a week. Tonight, eight on your size, Nico Clemens looks into which vaccine offers you the best protection. Nico joins us live from Tampa. Nico. Hey, Keith, Jenny, it's a scary thought. You get a vaccine hoping it'll uh, protect you from getting COVID. And while your chances are low, you can still get the virus. There are still going to be a lot of people who are fully vaccinated who continue to test positive. COVID-19 vaccine breakthrough cases are a growing concern across the country and here in Florida. A vaccine breakthrough case is when a fully vaccinated person gets infected with coronavirus. A spokesman with the Florida Department of Health in Hillsborough County tells Aid on Your Side, 6% of Florida cases right now are breakthrough cases, which is just a small percentage of the more than 165 million Americans who are fully vaccinated. If you're hearing about a lot of people around who are fully vaccinated, who are testing positive, that's okay. That is not any evidence that the vaccines don't work. So what are the chances of you getting the virus with Pfizer? or Moderna or Johnson & Johnson. Dr. Michael Tang with USF. You are a little bit more likely to get probably a breakthrough infection with Johnson & Johnson, but that's really, you know, we're talking about little margins compared to if you're completely unvaccinated. The AP reports Pfizer and Moderna were around 95% effective at preventing illness, while the Johnson & Johnson shot was 72% effective though direct comparisons are difficult. Dr. Jason Salami at USF's College of Public Health stresses that the vaccine wasn't designed to prevent you from getting infected, but to prevent you from getting extremely sick. The difference in efficacy is not dramatic, such that you should worry about waiting for one vaccine versus another. 